Welcome to this week's Nourish Cookery class brought to you by me, Jade Bradley. This week I will be making a plant-based mushroom stroganoff. Autumn is the season for mushrooms in the UK and Ireland, so this is the perfect time for this dish. Try adding some extra nutrient density into this dish by adding a side of veggies like broccoli, kale or any other veggies that you can get your hands on. I am going to serve this dish with brown rice because it's packed full of fibre which is essentially food for our gut bacteria. This is a perfect seasonal dish that is naturally vegan and gluten free without compromising on flavour. So these are the ingredients that I've got for this recipe. I've got mushrooms obviously for the mushroom stroganoff, some garlic, coconut milk, some fresh lemon juice, Dijon mustard, paprika. This is some parsley. You can use any fresh herbs you've got at hand. I'm using some spring onions because I was able to get the last of the bunch from my local farm. They won't be available for much longer because they're out of season now. Um, I am also using some broccoli to team with this recipe but you could use kale or any other veggies that you like so um, also we'll be using brown rice to serve. Start off by roughly chopping the mushrooms. I placed my brown rice on to cook at the start of this recipe along with the broccoli steaming above it. Next up I add my onions and garlic to heat on a medium temperature. I used spring onions, however brown and purple onions also work well. Then we will add the mushrooms to the pan with the garlic and the onions. Add a decent pinch of salt and pepper to the mushrooms in the pan. These will cook down for around 5 minutes. Make sure to stir them often. Once the mushrooms are soft, I add the paprika, the mustard and the lemon juice and stir well taking care not to get any seeds from the lemon in the dish. We can also add the coconut milk to the dish at this time. We will cook on a high heat as this helps the sauce to thicken nicely. I cook this for around 20 minutes. Ensure to keep stirring throughout every 5 or 10 minutes. You can also add some more salt and pepper at this stage if you desire. Once the rice and the broccoli were cooked, I removed these from the heat and drained them. Place these to the side until we are ready to serve. Lastly, to the stroganoff dish, I added the chopped parsley. Cook this for a further few minutes and then we are ready to serve. This dish is naturally vegan and gluten free. However, you can add meat or plant based alternatives to the dish if you wish. This recipe makes enough for four main portions. And there you have it, plant-based mushroom stroganoff. 